Lesson 8.4, Problem Solving, Compare Numbers to 20. We use the strategy Make a Model to match or count objects. We use cubes to model. Here's Ben. Ben has a number of orange cubes, one greater than 14. We see 10 ones and 4 ones. This is 14. If Ben has cubes one greater than 14, we can draw one more to show how many cubes Ben has. We draw one more cube, that's one more than 14, and we can count all the cubes, or we can see that he has 10 ones and 5 ones, which is 15. And we can write 15 for the number of cubes Ben has. Tala has a number of purple cubes one less than 16. Now here are 16 cubes. We have 10 ones and 6 ones. We can cross off one cube to show less, one less than 16. So if this is 16, we can circle this one and cross it off to show one less than 16. She has 10 ones and 5 ones. Well, that's 15. We can write the 15. That means they both have 15. They have the same number of cubes. The number of cubes they have are equal. 15 is equal to 15. When we look at the numbers, 1 more than 14 is 15, and 1 less than 16 is 15. Here there are 10 yellow cubes and two yellow cubes. 10 ones and two ones is 12. Here we have 10 green cubes and two green cubes. 10 ones and two ones is 12. When the numbers are the same, they are equal. 12 is the same as 12. 12 is equal to 12. Here's Gus. Gus has 19 crayons. We can draw 19 cubes to show his 19 crayons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19. We have one cube for each of his crayons. And Gus has a number that is two greater than Emma's crayons. Who has the greater number of crayons? Well, if he has a number that is two greater, that means he has two more. That means he has these two more than Emma. We can draw Emma's. We can make 10 cubes for 10 ones. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And we need to not draw these two. So we're going to draw 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 for Emma. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So Emma has ten ones and seven ones. Emma has seventeen. We need to circle the greater number. Nineteen is greater than seventeen because there's more cubes. And here's seventeen. Nineteen comes after. 17. And the greater number comes after in counting order. So we're going to circle 19. It's the greater number. It comes after 17 in counting order. Here's Jim. Jim has 16 cherries. We can use drawings of cubes to show the 16. We make 10. That's 2, 3, Four, five, six, seven, 
8, 9, 10, and 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. We make one cube for each cherry. Here's Lou. Lou has two less cherries than Jim. That means that Lou has two less, so we're not going to draw these. We're going to draw 10 and 1, 2, 3, 4. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 4 more. 1, 2, 3, 4. That means Lou has 14. He has 14 cherries. So who has less cherries? Which set has fewer? We need to circle the number that is less. And remember, the lesser number comes first in counting order. When we look at the counting order, here's 14 and here's 16. 14 comes first, so 14 is the lesser number. It's fewer. Lou has fewer cherries than Jim. 14 is less than 16. Here are 16 blue cubes and here are 19 red cubes. We need to circle the greater number. Remember, the greater number comes after in counting order and the greater number has more cubes. Do you think there's more cubes for 16 or 19? And we can look at the counting order. The greater number comes after. Here's 19 and here's 16. 19 comes after. So if you said 19 is the greater number, you're right. Here are 17 brown cubes and 19 blue cubes. We need to circle the lesser number. The lesser number comes first in counting order and has fewer cubes. We can see there's not as many cubes here. This one has these two more than this one. And 17 comes first in counting order. 17 is less than 19. If you said 17, you're right. So remember, the number that's greater comes after in counting order, and the number that's less comes first in counting order. Our next lesson, 8.5, we're going to count to 50 by ones. I hope you'll join me. I hope you have a great day, and I really wish you'd hit the like button for me. Bye.